Всем привет! С вами Штальвинг. И мы продолжаем. К счастью, тут было сохранение, действительно. А, так что смотрим, что тут. She convinced herself that she was awake. She's always been stubborn. I knew I had to end her dream. I had to wake her up. I had to rip down the poster she'd been staring at. Cut off her eyelids to make her see. To save her. А куда? Дальше вниз. He's still there somewhere. Locked inside. I know, because that's how it was for me. Почему не тридцатый уровень? А я прямо должна их? Убивай, да? Так где?
Вау, все, тут есть конец. Надо же. О, дальше проход. Темно, слишком темно. Ой, еще жетончик. А зачем мне жетончики вообще? Чем они там делают? Ну... Мне везет, что они мимо стреляют. Ну, это да стревает, кстати. Нет, только не вы. Я вас ненавижу. Вау! Что это было? Что такое это? Я не могу поднять. Блин. Ну то опять почти сначала. Что-то не появляется. О, господи, ну вот что вот это вообще было? К 
Какая длина. Противная штука. Опять с самого начала. Окей, это мне уже не нравится. Ладно, как-то надо быстро пробраться наверх, я думаю. Вау! Факин шет. А, я хотела сюда. Ух, собака. Да уроды, а! Где? Да. Собрать, 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 собрать. Ну, сколько можно? О, Господи, что за звуки? Конечно. Ой, я. Да откуда уже идут опять? О, неужели это все? Можем после этого сохранение какое-то? Я же так не могу больше.
как-то до него далеко. Здесь на этих одиночных-то они уже не будут попадать туда. Ой, я уже думала, я промажу сейчас. Dylan's in a coma. I don't know if there's anything of him left in there. If he'll ever find his way back. The portal's been closed, but the hiss is still in the oldest house. And the lockdown can't be lifted as long as any trace of it remains. I'm working on a solution with my management team, but there is still a long road ahead. I'm the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. We're in this together. You... and I. Ну что ж, вот теперь настоящий конец. Это было круто. Надеюсь, вам тоже понравилось. Если после титров можно будет вернуться, то я хочу еще раз в транзитный коридор сходить, попробовать повернуть платформу. Так что не отключайтесь.
Вау, какой у нас вид! Скрытые подсказки. Shawshank Redemption. That's the name of the movie I was thinking of earlier. Not important, but that was it. No, это мы и так поняли. Hey. I heard Pope was promoted. Head of research. What? The director's just handing out promotions? I guess you better get in there. <laughs> Pope is now head of research. It's official. Head of research? When was the review process? Why weren't we consulted? Calm down. It's pretty clear she earned it. I heard you closed the Hiss portal or uh, whatever it is we're calling it. If we could just flush out the stragglers. So, what's next for Simon Arish? Well, first off, I'm banning all slide projectors. That's it. <laughs> Seriously, though, we need to review our protocols. 
Research should not be making decisions that endanger the entire Bureau. Fuck it. The entire fucking world without some serious oversight. I think Pope would agree. Certain people in the Bureau have been working in the shadows for too long. And I'd like to make these HRAs part of the mandatory Bureau uniform. They're not stylish, but better safe than sorry. I don't think anyone will complain. Not after this. What are your thoughts on me serving as director? <laughs> well, I couldn't be more excited. I mean, look, don't get me wrong, Trench was fine, but... Well, you pulled us back from the brink, so... Well, I'm honored to serve, man. I mean, fuck, shit. <laughs> Faden. Sorry. He'll get it one day. <laughs> so, what's the situation in my bureau, Arish? The situation is we are still up to our eyes in his. Not to mention the months of repairs it's going to take just to get this place up and running again. But is it doable? Of course it is. You just might need to tell some rangers to grab a wrench once they're done hunting his. Did anyone ever mention to you that Darling was using a slide projector? Well, Salvador never did, but um, I doubt he even knew. Look, I'm well aware that it's our job to study and contain the things that we don't understand, but some of the things that Darling did were way outside of our mission statement. Look, these things are not toys, and acting like they are is only ever going to end one way. At least Pope seems to understand that. Well, it's secure now. No one can reach it without my say-so. Thank Christ for that. Marshall's been missing for a while now. Any ideas where she could be? The last time I saw her was in maintenance when I was leading the Rangers out of the Atlas. Yeah, I told her it wasn't safe, but she said she had to go check on something. Did you ask where she was going? Whew, Marshall is not the kind of person you question. <laughs> kind of intimidating, you know? But, uh, she was by herself. If that helps at all. Not really, but thanks. Hopefully she turns up. I'll see you later. You know where I'll be. Okay. There haven't been many kiss sightings in the Ocean View Motel. Could survivors be hiding inside? It's possible. I remember a report about a similar incident from 84. The Bureau lost contact with a whole department during the last show. The department head was found in the motel two years later. His arm stuck in the vending machine. Make a note to send in a search party when possible. Так, что тут у меня еще Так, а что было-то тут? Тебе проектор? paper lists all the things wrong in the world. The list grows longer by the day. The difference between the morning and the night. Coffee. 
whiskey. No other difference. The alarm goes off at 5 a.m. It feels like I just closed my eyes. It's dark. I sit up on the bed in the gloom. I get up, I shower. The driver waits for me downstairs, takes me to the oldest house. An old man stares at me in the car window. It's raining. It's dark. Late at night, he brings me back here. It's not a home. It's a room where I sleep in. Waking up just as tired as I was before going to bed. Endless grind. Так. Ну, что ты хочешь мне сказать? Jesse, good to see you. We've got Dylan situated in his containment cell like you asked. I've got medical staff running tests as we speak and I'd be happy to walk you through the details later. Other than that, what's next? With the slide projector turned off, the hisser shut out, but we're stuck with the ones already here. We can't lift the lockdown until they're all eradicated. If any hiss ever got out, that would be the end of everything. Well, eliminating them all will take time. Look, I'll do what I can on my end, but my research is progressing slower than I'd like. I think I can help with that. I am making you the head of research, effective immediately. I want you to use everything the Bureau has, every resource, every confidential scrap of data, and find a way to keep the hiss out for good. That's... really? I, I mean, yes, yes, I can certainly... Yes! <laughs> yes, I accept. You'll do great. Besides, I didn't really have anyone else lined up. I'm honored, Jesse, really. Thank you. Personal was not a bit more than she was. Do you remember Mr. Tomasi, the head of communications? The hiss he was changed into showed up in containment, near the turntable. I'll take care of it. That thing's not getting away this time. I've heard reports about his particular use of language and intonation when repeating the hiss babbling. The biological and behavioral distinctions between different hiss corrupted individuals is truly fascinating. I wonder if I could categorize the data. And she's already off on her own thing. <laughs> How do you feel about me taking over as director? You act like it just happened. You've been director since we first met, remember? I am still thrilled. Nothing's changed. Not for me. But the Bureau has changed. Trench and Darling are gone. Their knowledge, anything not written down, disappeared with them. They knew the Bureau better than anyone. They're the Bureau's past, Emily. We won't operate like they did. We'll learn from their mistakes. We'll be better than they ever were. We won't ever be like them. When the hiss got into my head, I saw some weird things. I think Darling even spoke to me. Does that make any sense to you? Well, empirically, no, but... Phantom voices, as well as hallucinatory states, are not uncommon here. And considering the forces that Dr. Darling was working with, he could have been transferred to a different plane of consciousness, physically or otherwise. And that doesn't upset you? Oh, very. And the fact that he hid those forces from me? It's infuriating. But Darling's dream was always to look beyond our reality. This time he may have taken a step too far. 
But as long as his consciousness can perceive his surroundings, I'm sure he's loving it. Maybe Darling was just trying to protect you from the darker side of his work. Fuck that. I'm not a child. Like, don't just assume I'm gonna consider something morally repugnant. Which it all was. Which it all was, of course. How was Dylan? The same. I, I can't detect any his activity, but his physiology has certainly been altered by it. And I can't tell if his brain activity is genuine or simply the aftermath of the hiss, like spasms. Dylan could wake up tomorrow for all I know. I really can't say. Then I just have to wait for him. That's fair. He waited a long time for me. Don't worry. We'll be monitoring him around the clock. If he wakes up, we'll be ready. I don't mean that in a hostile way, just... Well, you know. I hear you. My brother isn't exactly popular around here. I hope one day he'll have the chance to change that. So, there was a moment after Hedron died that I couldn't feel my powers. The hiss got into my head. Just for a moment. So that explains the HRA outage. Before we knew what was happening, the hiss had us. They were in my head. I saw terrible things. I mean, I was about to go under forever when the hiss was pushed back. The HRAs had come back on. Dylan vanished afterwards, and we fought off the hiss that came after him. So if Hedron's death knocked out the HRAs, that means there must be a new local source for them to relay. Which, I'm guessing, must be... Me. You. Hedron is dead, assuming that word even applies to a resonant-based life form. But whatever it awakened in you, the power you call Polaris, is still active. Or at least, that's what my instruments are telling me. I don't think we're ever gonna understand all of this. And I'm okay with that. I'm just glad you're here with me. That's good to know. Thanks, Emily. I found Dylan attacking the astral plane and the board. What was he hoping to accomplish? Huh. Since they arrived, his have been corrupting objects of power, which have an inherent link to the astral plane. Maybe their goal was to access the astral plane and the board itself. That still doesn't tell us why. His motives are a difficult thing to work out, but I have been digging through confidential files and noticed a strange gap in knowledge regarding the board. Looks like any data on them has either been deleted or was never gathered in the first place. Then maybe it's time someone looked into that. Maybe it is. Well, I've got a bureau to run. See you soon. Yes, ma'am, Director Faden. Please, Emily. Not even as a joke. Okay. Where are the files on the I found a couple of relevant files. Doc, what do you? What the hell? What the hell? Ну и это... Семьдесят одна тысяча. Вау! Так, посмотрим, что у нас с одеждой. Эп. Тихо, тихо. Ой, ужас.
Зачем я это делаю? Классный костюмчик. Так, что у нас с миссиями? Не надо. Так, вот это. Оказывается, пока шли титры, я тут немного посмотрела. Оказывается, его надо искать изначально совершенно не там. Я надеюсь, что он у меня... Что у меня будет тот человек, который должен дать нам вход в ту дверь. Надо же, никто не вылетает. Так, да, туда. help over there I'm here what happened to you I uh, got in a little scrap name's Horowitz I oh ah. is he gonna be okay don't look at me like that I'm fine but Wells is still in there you gotta get him out who's Wells my squad mate we were hunting a runaway altered item we followed it down into the clocks the clocks uh, a threshold The Bureau sealed it up years back because of all the clocks. We, w we followed the altered item inside, but the way it was acting, we weren't ready. Me and Wells were the only ones to make it to the motel court. He was right behind me, but he never showed up on this side. I'll go find him. But first, you need to get to a medic. Uh, Wells is the medic. Please, you gotta get him out of there. I'll be fine, really. Root can patch me up later. Fine. But I'll be back for you. I <laughs> damn well hope so. <laughs> Just use the motel cord there. It should get you into the clocks. Sorry. The threshold. Okay, главное, чтобы тебя тут хисы не достали. Надеюсь, это правильно.
Так. This Wells guy can't be far. Ага, вот мы где. Those must be the clocks he was talking about. Чего так много? Не раздваиваются? That must be our guy. Ой, простите. Эй, hey, окей. Okay? Are you Wells? Your friend asked me to come looking for you. That must be Horowitz. Glad he got out. I stayed back to help the others. Did a shit job of it, clearly. You tried. That's enough. Horowitz needs your help now. How do we get out of here? We should head back through the threshold. We can look for other survivors as we go. We better hurry. Which way? Just follow the blood. Let's go. Подожди, не ходи никуда. Так, не, не сюда, конечно. Куда ты там хотел-то? Threshold effect. This used to be a regular office wing before the threshold manifested. The forces at play in there got a hold of someone's old clock and started duplicating. Now the office is abandoned and its clocks all the way down. Underhill.
Ай, он так прикольный. Мне только ради Дарвинга я хочу делать фишку, вдруг он там есть. Так, ты не беги так. Обход? Какой обход? Где я тут возьму обход? Фикинный? Окей, можно ли где-то взлететь? Что, якорь сбежал, что ли? А, это самый почтовый ящик. Да, точно был почтовый ящик. Помню, помню. Эй, пошли. Это Унил. Ну, он сказал. Так, что это часики затикали? Ох, как я этих не люблю! Подожди, не убегай. Д 
Вдруг они все звонят. Какой щит? Ладно, подожди с этим. Что такое? Тоди подальше. Так, а куда нам надо там? Так-то тут ногу можно сломать. <laughs> так, мы почти на месте. We're not far now. Вот. 
Come on. The motel court is on the other side of logistics. Horowitz should still be there. Да, я боюсь, что до него уже добрались. Стоп, я сохранюсь. Подождите. Как это я? Хоровец. Живой. Так. Элс. Ты где потерялся? поговорить надо let's go shit не знаю ровно только что hardwoods oh god no Уэллс, может, ты уйдешь отсюда? Ты подожди, ты куда ты идешь? I'm sorry about your friend. Thanks, and thanks for coming to get me. Horowitz's HRA must have been damaged in the threshold. The guy never put himself first. At least the anchor altered item is still locked away down in the clocks. I hope it rots down there. That altered item needs to be dealt with before it hurts anyone else. I should go back down and contain it. Head to the executive sector, Wells. They could use a medic. Thank you, Director. I'll go see what good I can do there. Ничего, обследуй. Так, сейчас еще к Лэнгстону сходим. power contained in one place is a risk makes me wonder what other dangers are locked away inside the bureau how the hell did an astral spike end up in the archive those poor records are gonna get torn to shreds sir I am required to inform you that all records are property of the bureau not of any one individual And I am required to inform you that the Astral Spike's origins may be a confidential matter and should not be inquired upon by low-clearance personnel. Would you two stop doing 
whatever it is you're doing. And I'm not low clearance. <laughs> I found all those missing altered items. All of them? Wow, you have a gift, ma'am. But those weren't all of the altered items missing from the Panopticon. Cornelius. The hiss must be making them restless. We've had several more containment breaches. How many of these things did he lose? How many? Just a couple. Should be no problem for you. I really appreciate your help. Really. Just. Super. <laughs> Can I get a situation report for the sector? Whew, okay, uh, we still have to perform a proper inventory of the cells. Lord knows how many altered items snuck out during all this. Staffing. We definitely lost some people. Uh, gonna have to hit those college career fairs, am I right? Huh. I'm Hard to imagine the FBC at job fairs. The hiss are still tearing up the place faster than we can fix it, but the containment sector is stable. Ish. Considering the alternative, I'm happy with stable ish. Any thoughts on me serving as director? I know it was a sudden change. Oh, uh. No complaints so far. Trench was all secrets, lots of meetings behind closed doors. You seem much more approachable. But if I can give you some advice, ma'am, keep a grip on who you are. I've been here a long time, and I don't know if it's the job or this place, but people change here, and not for the better. I'll try to keep my head on straight. Will you stay on after things calm down, Langston? Are you asking if I'm quitting? Oh, no, ma'am. I'm not having some mid-level agent make a mess of my panopticon. Plus, I'm racking up serious overtime hours with this lockdown. Just don't take too long clearing out the hiss. My cat gets... separation anxiety. I'll do what I can. He must have gotten a pet sitter. I'll see you later, Langston. I'll be here. Like always. Oh, now the trench is gone. Rest of soul. I really need to dig up my old proposal and better containment practices. More ritual worship, iconography, the whole shebang. Окей. Итак, что у нас еще осталось? Значит, беглецы. Резиновая утка сбежала. Плесень. Все-таки надо делать. Тамаси. И это. Возможно, что-то еще появится. Ну, возможно, нет. Еще надо бы как-то к Андерхилл сходить на по-любому что-нибудь еще даст. Так что мы еще не совсем закончили. Ну что ж, на этом на сегодня все. Благодарю за просмотр. Всем счастливо. Продолжение следует.